Hush Tea Bar wants to introduce the community to more than just tea. Its mission? To build empathy among its clients and its employees. Its team is fully made up of deaf people as well as those with mental health conditions. To address their needs better, flexible work arrangements are in place, including a trust-based leave system where medical certificates aren't required. This is particularly important for employees like JJ, who's recovering from depression and borderline personality disorder. I had to quit my initial job uh, during the long-term treatment. And that's kind of like unhealthy. I mean, if let's say uh, you were to keep uh, changing job, it, it, it also kind of add um, extra mental health stress. Bigger companies in Singapore are introducing welfare policies too. For instance, Otsuka Pharmaceuticals holds weekly engagement sessions where team leaders can check in on employee morale, while the Agency for Integrated Care provides a peer support system. But there's still some way to go in turning Singapore into a haven for inclusive employment. A recent study by the National Council of Social Services found that only two in five employees feel like their companies provide adequate support for their mental well-being. I think the first thing a company needs to do is maybe get an outside-in approach uh, where they get consultants or support to basically indicate and, and help them redesign the benefits that they offer people uh, and what is actually required for mental health support. But meeting the team's spectrum of mental and emotional needs can be no picnic. We still have those interpersonal challenges. When that happens, it actually, I must say, are also more emotionally uh, intense, understandably, you know, because all of us are a bit more sensitive because of what we've come through. This is where counselling sessions that the company provides come in to help staff better understand each other. With human relationships or social relationships, they find it a little bit more difficult. But with a lot of uh, understanding from the environment, they blossom, they can contribute because they have the capability and skills. Dr Tan hopes to see the stigma surrounding mental health fade until it might one day become like having poor eyesight, a condition that's easily accommodated.